suppose we know that an object is has a mass of 5 kg so basically the weight 5 g newton and the reaction force they would cancel each other out so basically it would be r equals to 5 g so they would cancel each other out they're equal but the main uh, motion is working on this plane along this plane so there would be motion over here so there is a forward force of this is unknown this forward force is unknown and now we know this is rough surface so the friction we know maximum friction is mu r so that maximum friction uh, suppose mu is 0.5 this is given and r we know is 5 g so this is 5 g so this is going to be friction is going to be 2.5 g newton that is the friction now it is given that this object is moving forward but with a steady speed steady speed means acceleration is zero so the question is find the value of the forward force find the value of f so in this case what we know is that net force uh, which is forward force is f minus the friction is uh, mu r is 2.5 g newton now we know net force equals to uh, mass into acceleration the mass is 5 kg and the acceleration is zero that means f minus 2.5 g newton is zero Therefore, F is going to be equals to 2.5 G Newton. If you have another situation uh, where we have an object, so there is a there is a surface over here, and the object is uh, 3 kg. The mass is 3 kg, so this has a weight of 3 G Newton, and there is a reaction force R. So we know the reaction force and the weight will cancel each other out so this is going to be r equals to 3 g newton now if this is moving forward and it has a force of 25 newton and this is moving uh, there is a friction over here and friction is mu r so mu r is 3 g newton so that is basically the friction now it is given that this is accelerating and it has an acceleration of 3 meter per second squared and that is the given acceleration 3 meter per second squared so the question is find the value of mu so we can use the concept of how the uh, net force equal to mass into acceleration works so we know that net force equals to the forward force is 25 newton and the one that is pulling it down is pu, uh, mu into 3g 3 mu g and this is the net force and we know net force equal to mass into acceleration so mass is 3 kg and acceleration is 3 meter per second squared so this is 25 minus 3 mu g if you do the calculation this would be 3 mu g equals to 25 minus 9 so that means 3 mu g equals to 16 so therefore mu is going to be 16 divided by 3 g and then the value of mu would be so 16 divided by 3 into 9.8 so 3 into 9 0.8 and the value of mu is 0 0.544 0 0.544